we have a uh, group, uh, we have an alias. That means we have a, a mailing uh, alias a group of people at Pixar. We call them Pix Noise. Oh, that's cute. Uh, so all of us are, who are part of that alias, actually, we get together for two reasons. One is to eat. Wait, you guys have been eating? We've been eating all the time, not inviting other people. No, you time. weren't part of that. So we, we would have afternoons. We would have salo salo. We would have, we would have like uh, uh, potluck. and bring food in, and then but also we also hold charity events. We hold kind of like auctions so that we can uh, 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 donate to charities for typhoon relief here and then other charities as well. So it's a very active and very friendly group. We we they're always smiling and you know. I'm, I'm saying hello to you all, you guys, on their behalf. So that's that's our group. Pete, uh, uh, well, this part of our presentation is like, well, a long time ago I wanted to join Pixar because I love Toy Story and I was so depressed that I couldn't be part of Pixar and work for a different company. And uh, I interviewed the Pixar. This is what, this is my entire story. I interviewed the Pixar, and they said, yeah, that would be interesting if you can join us. And everybody. Um, met me in this room full of drawings with monsters. I said, like, oh, they're making a movie about monsters. I would love to be part of this. Meanwhile, we had a couple of story artists that I loved, and I said, how did you learn this? He said, I learned everything from this guy, Ronnie Del Carmen. I was like, great, get him in. So on the day that they did say yes, after a couple of months, I, I, I'm an employee. I walk in, and they bring me to a room. It's like, what's happening? This room is full of drawings of fishes. <laughs> what happened? So I suspected that Pete Doctor didn't want to hire me. <laughs> Which is not true. Which is not true. Yeah. But uh, Somebody else got the scoop. But we got to work together on uh, uh, Up. Yeah. I was his, his uh, story supervisor. Do you know that beginning part of the movie where we see Carl and Ellie uh, fall in love and live together and, and all of that? That's Four and a half minutes that Ronnie uh, boarded, and uh, a lot of great stuff. Well, I did not do it by myself. I have wonderful directors and co-directors, you know, Pete and Bob Peterson and the story team. So I, I just kind of like um, handled it so that it, it, it'd be a little shorter, and we, we added that punch at the end, and we were always worried that I wonder if people are going to recover from this. <laughs> but they did, which is great. You yeah. brought us back. You the other back. thing, uh, just talk, talking, getting to this film. So Ronnie was had a story on, on Up, and then uh, we decided to work together on this film, and Ronnie, of course, co-directing.